guys, welcome back to the channel. My name's Designer Slash Gamer, and today we are playing Lego Worlds. You guys remember Sheila? Uh, Sheila has a brand new car. It's a pink Cadillac. You can get this pink Cadillac by entering the code 8B3VEQ, and then you can place it in your game. And it's amazing. Look at this. It came, I think it came right around the same time as the 50s diner and the new uh, 50s garage. So Sheila is pretty pumped about it because, I mean, who wouldn't be pumped about a pink Cadillac? I mean, look at her. <laughs> so you guys, we are heading up to Max's new house to do some house sitting because Max is out of town. He's working on some building project. So we're gonna head up there, we're gonna feed his cat. He's got a black cat, she's kinda mean. Her name is Kim Claudashian. She's not very nice. And she only likes one kind of food, but we forgot to ask him what kind of food. So we got some fancy feast, and I hope that's gonna be the right kind that she likes. You know, I, I guess we'll find out. So Sheila, why don't we uh, drive on the brand new road up to Max's house? I have a feeling this is gonna be somewhat difficult. Cause this car, ooh. Cause this car is big and it's already kind of difficult to drive in Lego worlds. Look out, horsey. <laughs> it's gonna take a while, you guys. <laughs> Look out, buddy. You guys, it has headlights, it's pretty cool. Okay, so then now we're just gonna... <laughs> can, we, can we get through this tunnel? I don't know, Sheila. I mean, this is... We might need bigger tunnels in Ivory City for this ginormous Cadillac. Can we even fit through here? <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's back up a little bit, see if we can turn some more. Oh, this is gonna be rough, you guys. Oh, I was hoping we could just like ram it and go for it, but nope. All right, Sheila, ram it, ram it. Oh, we're so close, there we go. Okay, yes, we did it. <laughs> that is the music from the diner playing and we can hear it in the tunnel. So now we have to try to turn right. So this is the drive-in movie theater and you know what, Sheila, your car, is perfect for the drive-in movie theater. It's a convertible. I mean, there's no better car for a drive-in movie theater than a convertible, right, Sheila? <laughs> okay, so we are going to keep driving up to Max's house because uh, Kim Claudashian is hungry. She needs her fancy feast. All right, let's see if we can navigate up here. The new portion of Ivory City is up at the top of this hill, so we had to build a ramp to get up there. So now we're gonna try to uh, drive up there. Nice, Sheila, that's amazing. <laughs> Look at her. So it's pretty steep, uh, but apparently it's still, you can still drive on it. So we're driving up here to the top of the ramp and we're gonna look at Ivory City. <gasps> oh man. So if you guys watched the last episode, we built this awesome diner and we put some purple um, neon lights on it and it looks really, really cool at night. Right, Sheila? Yeah, okay. <laughs> All right. So we're gonna keep going up here over to Max's house. So let's see. Oh, we got some nasty skeletons over here. Get out of here, buddy. All right, oh, Sheila. We don't wanna drive off the edge of the cliff here. <gasps> this car is huge. I mean, Cadillacs are really big cars, so I'm not really that surprised that this Cadillac, this Lego Cadillac is huge. Okay. Let's back up a little bit, try to turn some more, Sheila. <laughs> Watch out, cow. Watch out, buddy. Okay. All right, Sheila. Oh, is that Max's car? Why did he take his car with him? He went out of town. All right, Sheila, be careful. Don't don't hit Max. <gasps> okay, well. Sheila, did you just hit Max's car? Dang it, now your rates are gonna go up. All right. No. Uh oh, are we gonna get stuck in a car loop here? Yep. So you guys, this can happen sometimes. If you're next to a car and you park a car and you jump out, you just keep switching cars. It's a problem. Um, but it's an easy fix. We're just gonna back up uh, Max's car here. Oh, <laughs> we're gonna hop out. And now we're out. And it's so much quieter. How nice is this? Okay, Sheila, let's go, let's go in. Uh, oh, I just heard Kim Claudashian. She's getting hungry. Uh, let's go down here and, uh, oh, that's right. Sheila, Max has an alarm. Do you have the alarm code written down? Do you, 
Yeah? Okay. Alright, we gotta put the alarm code in here. Alright, ready? Let's see, where's the, where's the control pad? Oh, I guess it's just hidden in the wall here. Okay, Sheila, why don't you go ahead and put that alarm in here? Okay, let's see. What's what's the code there? It's one, two, three, four. That's his code? Really? I mean, who would pick that? What, Sheila? You have the same code on your luggage? I feel like you should probably change that. It's kind of the worst code in the world, other than like all zeros. What? Oh, all zeros is your alarm on the ivory tower? <sighs> Sheila. All right, did you put the code in? Yeah, one, two, three, four. No, not one, two, two, four. <gasps> Oh, great. Oh, no. Oh, Sheila. Now the cops are gonna show up. Oh, oh great. Sheila, did you hear? Oh, no. Here's the cops. Oh, hey, hey, cops. Um, yeah, I know you're eager to get some donuts, but, uh, yeah, we set off the alarm. Yeah, we, we're, we're house-sitting for Max, so we're, we're allowed to be here. Oh. Password? Uh, Chill, did he did he tell you a password for the alarm? Construction? So, construction is that the right is that the right password? She is that? <gasps> Sheila, that's the wrong password. Uh, is it traffic cone? Oh, that's it. I mean, hopefully Max doesn't ever get like some real criminals that try to rob his house because. If they don't guess one, two, three, four, they're certainly gonna guess traffic cone as his password, because you know he's in construction. You know, Sheila, we gotta we gotta help him out, and we have to change the code to the ivory tower too. I mean, zero, zero, zero. Sheila, really, really, Sheila, really. I mean, that's really. You think that's a good idea? No. Okay. <laughs> okay, let's get down here and let's feed uh, Kim Kardashian her her uh, her food here. Ooh. Oh, there she is. Oh, hey. Hey, we got some Fancy Feast for you. What? Yeah, it's it's Fancy Feast. What do you mean? No, I don't, I don't know. It's, it's like Chicken Delight or something. It's, oh, you don't want that? What? You only eat Upstream Dream? We didn't get Upstream Dream. We got Chicken Delight. Here. Come here, kitty. No, you don't. <sighs> All right, Sheila. Let's see if we can find anything else for the cat to eat, because... Kim Kardashian doesn't want chicken delight. All right, let's see what's in here. What's, what do we got here? Got any fish in here? What do we got? Oh, there's an apple. Where'd she go? Hey, come back here. Wait. Hey, what, you, you want a fish now? I think we might have a fish. Let's see. We don't, uh oh. Sorry, Kim. We don't have a fish. Sheila, we're gonna have to get a fish and feed this poor cat. Oh, you know what, Sheila? You probably have fish in your inventory. Let's see here. Let's see if we can put a fish box down and then feed this poor, poor, sweet, hungry. Here we go. Let's put a fish box down. All right. Let's break the fish box open. Oh, gross. That's really stinky. All right. Come on, fish. Come here. There we go. All right. Where the, where's this cat? Come here, kitty. Oh, now she's sleeping. Come here, is this the fish you want? No? Oh, we got the wrong fish. Dang it, Sheila. Oh, this cat. Okay, well, you know what, Kim Kardashian, you're just gonna have to wait to get your dinner because we don't have the right, the right cat food. <laughs> All right, Kim, well, you're just gonna have to wait to get your dinner until we find the fish that you want. Um, we're actually going on an adventure to find things we haven't discovered yet, so we'll keep an eye out for this particular fish. For Kim, so she, you know, because she's she's hungry. Um, but you guys, we are going to go on an adventure because we still have more gold bricks to discover. We have more vehicles to discover. We have more characters to discover. We have more brick builds to discover. We need to go on an adventure to discover those things. So, Sheila, are you ready for an adventure? Yeah. So in the last, uh, in a few episodes ago, a couple of episodes ago for uh, the Christmas episode. We found a unicorn for Elle, and we didn't have a lot of time to explore that world, so we're gonna go back to the unicorn world now and see what we can find. 
And then at the end of the episode, we're gonna come back to Ivory City and we're going to do some work on the Ivory Tower. We've been kind of neglecting the Ivory Tower. We've had other construction projects going on and we've been expanding the city, but we need to get back to the tower. We wanna to change the stairs and we wanna build a really cool courtyard out front uh, of the tower so that guests that are coming to visit can like hang out in the courtyard while Sheila's like doing whatever she's doing before she comes down to greet him. So Sheila, should we get to the rocket ship? Yeah? <laughs> okay. All right, you guys, we are going to head to the rocket ship and we will see you when we get to this new world. Sheila's in the rocket ship and she's going to this cool new world. All right, you guys, we have landed. And this world, I mean, you guys, look at this map. Hey, what's wrong with the rocket? Pugsy, dude, what's going on, bro? You okay? Guys, the rocket's freaking out. Calm down, dude. So you guys, this world, we are so pumped to explore this world. Like we were just saying earlier, we came here briefly, we found a unicorn um, for L for Christmas and then we got out of here. We didn't really have time to explore or do any quests. But you guys, look at this map. How many, what a one, two, three, four, five, six dungeons. One, two, three, four, five, five, I can't count, six towns. <sighs> I mean, this is like a gold mine of a map, and we're really excited to explore it. Um, Sheila, put those bones away, they're so silly. No, no gems. So I'm wondering how we should explore this. Should we hop on a broomstick? Should we run around for a little bit? Why don't we run around for a little bit? Just, oh, we've got a gold brick right here, you guys. Two gold bricks. What? This is, wait, is she being attacked? Sheila, just in case, why don't you get out a weapon? Let's see, what are those zombies? Usually usually you use uh, black weapons on zombies. So let's see what's going on here. Where'd she go? Hey lady, what's going on lady? Oh, it is zombies. All right, let's get him. Let's get him, Sheila. Come on, get him. Okay, where's the other one? <gasps> Come back. Get him. All right, where's the other ones? There's a, get her. It's a zombie cheerleader. Yeah. Is there more? <gasps> Dang it! No! <gasps> she get it! Yeah! We got that gold brick! Yay! <laughs> Alright, Sheila, it's time for the gold brick dance! It's the gold brick dance! It's a classic! <laughs> 117 gold bricks. You know what? We need at least 200. I think when you get 200, you unlock this special Pugsy that you can, like, fly around in the world. Oh, hey! What do you want, an apple? All right, we got an apple for you. Did we discover her, Sheila? We already discovered her. We discovered her. No, don't hit her, Sheila. <laughs> Dang it. We're already making enemies. Is she still following us? No, all right, she's good. So yeah, you press F to discover them, but F also smacks them. So I feel like they should probably change that, right, Sheila? Okay, why don't we head to a dungeon? <gasps> but first, you know what we should do? Let's check out this ruin. Let's go into first person here. See what it's like from Sheila's point of view. Ooh. Can you guys imagine living in a Lego world? I mean, it's like, it's like heaven. <laughs> hey, Squirrely. What's up, buddy? What do you want, a berry? I don't think we have any berries. You guys, this is so cool. So that, we built a church in Ivory City and we built some arches, but we didn't do it like this. I really like how this is like, different layers of arches. That looks really neat. We'll have to do that on a different building in the future. I think it'd be really cool to build a gothic I, uh, a gothic skyscraper and we could use that same arch for that. It'd be really neat. Okay, let's see. Is there anything in the ruins? Nope, just some squirrelies. Okay, you guys, why don't we find... Let's go to... Hey, squirrely! Let's head towards one of these dungeons. I wonder which one's closest. Hmm. Okay, let's head this way. You guys, is that one of the dungeons over there? Oh, dungeon time, Sheila. It's dungeon time. Dungeons are so fun. So, you know, in Minecraft, they have those dungeons too. I like, when I played Minecraft, it like genuinely scared me. Like I was always afraid of creepers jumping out. It's like scary. That's scary stuff. Oh, speaking of scary. 
Should we check out what's on top before we go on the inside here? Maybe we do that. Since it's about to get dark. Let's see, how do we get up there? We have to climb up the building here. Oh, are these stairs? So you guys, I really would like to build a dungeon um, in the game, but I think it would be really difficult. But uh, you know what? It's a good, It's it would be really fun. Um, okay, what do we got up here? Got any bad guys? Hello? Hello? Sheila, why don't you get a torch out? I think we should get a torch out, because this is kind of scary. It's dark. All right, let's see. Uh, red flame? Oh yeah. <laughs> okay, there we go. Well, that's cool, look at that. In first person perspective, you can see the torch there glowing. That's neat. All right. We've got a treasure chest here, let's get some money. There we go. Get that. I know Sheila, she's scared of dungeons. It's gonna be all right, girl. It's gonna be all right, let's see what's up here. Hello? I know, I know, I know. It's scary. I hear a treasure chest. Oh, there's one. Okay. You got it. Alright. Let's go up here. Oh, you guys, this is scary. Okay, we got that. Is that all of them? I think I can hear more. How do we get up? Oh, there's the stairs. Okay, here we go. Ooh, scary old skeletons. There we go. Get some more money. And maybe one more here? All right. I think that's all of them. All right, Sheila, let's hop down. Okay. All right, where's the entrance? I think we lost it. Is it over here? There it is. Oh, okay. All right, Sheila, here we go. Oh, it's dark down here. You know what, Sheila? I think we're going to need the lantern. Because this is not cutting it. The lantern is usually much brighter, yep, than the torches. And it's not as loud, which is nice. Okay. I hear a treasure chest. Is it, like, inside the wall? We'll get that later. Let's just do some uh, dungeon, some good old-fashioned dungeon exploring. So you guys know in the classic Mario Brothers game, those underground, wait, the castle levels, like on World 4, those are so hard. I've actually never beaten the first Mario. I've beaten the second Mario and the third Mario, but I have never, still to this day, been able to beat the classic Super Mario Brothers I get to like 8-1 or 8-2 and I can't make that stupid jump and <laughs> it's so dumb. Okay, we got dead skeletons here. Dead skeletons. <gasps> Are they coming back to life? Uh oh, Sheila. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's get out our, our black katana here. Maybe the crystal simter. <gasps> get him! It's so dark in here, you guys. Oh my gosh, I can't see anything. <laughs> Sheila's just like... Hoping she hits something with it. <gasps> Where is he? Oh, there he is! Sheila, get him! Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Sheila! Get him! Okay. Alright, let's get our... Let's get our, um... Lantern back out. Because I can't see anything. This is so dark. Okay, which way should we go? Oh, where do we come from, even? I think we came from this way. So why don't we go this way? dead end. There's a treasure chest back there, but we're gonna get that later. Do some exploring here. Alright, let's see. Uh, what's that? Oh, it's a torch. That scared me. <laughs> oh no! Look out! <gasps> oh, these spike floors. Oh, and they're timed differently. When did they? Okay, I feel like they changed that. I don't... I think they used to all kind of be in unison. <gasps> oh, it's a dead end. Of course it is. Of course it is. Why wouldn't it be? Go, Sheila! Run, run, run! It's really cool how they build these, you guys. This, this, like, this would take forever to build this. I can't even imagine how long it would take to build this. Okay, Sheila, run. Careful, careful, careful! <gasps> oh man. 
Run, run, Sheila, run. What's this? <gasps> Look out! <laughs> All right. Go through here. Is this another dead end? No. Okay. All right. Oh, Sheila, look at these. These are statue heads, like they're lion heads, and they're spewing out lava. How do we get over there? Should we just risk it? Just jump in. Sorry, Sheila! Okay. We burned her bum. It's all for the cause, though. We got a lot of money. All right, can we make that jump without burning her bum again? Ah! Sorry, Sheila. She's gonna be mad at me now. <gasps> oh! Okay, that's a dead end. All right. Is that everything? I think maybe that's everything. Do we go? Oh, wait. This looks new. Wait, no. No, we've been that way. Okay, I think it's this way. Where the skeleton spawner is. Sheila, run! Oh, great. Dead end. Dang it. Get off! Okay, just run, Sheila. <laughs> Treasure chest? Yes. Oh, sorry. Sorry, Sheila. Where is Whoa. it? Oh, there it is. <laughs> there we go. Nice. Okay. Oh, look, they're all waiting for us. All right, Sheila, jump. Ah! <gasps> Sheila, run! <laughs> Are they still coming after us? Yep. All right, where did we come in? Is it over here? Uh, it's over here, I think. There it is. Okay, let's get out of here. <laughs> that was a cool dungeon. It wasn't one of those crazy big dungeons, though, where you get, like, a key and a treasure chest to unlock. Is it nighttime? Oh, it looks like it's... Is it morning time? Oh, nice. Perfect. All right. So let's go, let's go investigate one of these towns. So why don't... Sheila? Sheila, do you see that? Do you, uh... There's a rainbow castle, rainbow something up there. Yeah. <laughs> All right, we are going to hop on a broom and we're gonna go visit this rainbow castle in the clouds. You guys, look at this. Did you guys even know this was in the game? I didn't even know this was a thing. You guys, this game, I have to give the, the developers props because this game continues to surprise me after playing it for almost a year. We're constantly finding new things. It's, it's just incredible. And let's hop off the broom. Make sure we're over the cloud before we do. We don't want to. Oh, careful, Sheila. Where'd the broom go? We lost the broom. So sometimes troublemakers get on my nerves because they're loud, especially when I'm trying to build and you hear them like, making their obnoxious sounds. What is, what does he even have? What is that, a donut? A shell? Okay, we're gonna have to get him because I can't deal with this. Come here, you little rat. Come here, shut up. There we go. <gasps> All right, get out of here. You're, who is this? Oh, hi, hi. No, Sheila, jump out of there. Uh oh, are there zombies around here? Do you see that, Sheila? <gasps> we better get the black katana. No, 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 not the, not the lantern. We need the, we need a weapon here. Okay. Let's talk to her. No, not not sit in the... Sheila, jump out. Where'd she go? No, where's the king? Okay, let's see, where... Oh, hey guys, how you guys doing? Where are these zombies? Oh, they're everywhere, apparently. Okay, where are they then? Where are they at? Wait, you got zombies somewhere? Are they down on the ground? <gasps> they up here? Wow, this is really neat. I like the gold and the clear bricks here. Okay, so apparently you have a zombie problem, but I don't see any zombies. So where are your zombies? Let's go into first person here and see if we can find these zombies. 
That's not a zombie. That's a queen. Hey, queen. You see any zombies around here? No. Yeah, I know. We, we can't find them either. Hey, king. What's the matter with you, buddy? You want a bearded man? Sheila, what are you doing? Will you get off of that? <laughs> oh, God. Ooh, what's up here? <gasps> Look at these rainbow stairs. I want to build some rainbow stairs. Those are really neat. What's up here? Treasure chests? Ooh. Look at that's really neat. All right, let's get this money. Sorry guys, we're just going to we're going to rob you blind here. Cuz we always need money. All right, let's see. What else do we got up here? I don't know where these uh, these alleged zombies. <gasps> Look at all these chandeliers. This is really neat. I thought Elle's house in the clouds was cool, but honestly, this is much cooler. <laughs> Maybe we should upgrade Elle's house. All right, let's see what's in this treasure chest. What is that? Was that a brick build? What was that? Is this some kind of brick build? Cool. Uh, sweet. Okay. Look, this is so neat. The patterns on the floor and the golden railings. Okay, but where are these zombies? Where are the... Yeah, I know. I know you think you got a zombie problem, but there's there's no zombies in here. All right, let's discover this throne. Cause that's pretty cool. And let's get this money. And uh, this money over here. We got queen out of the way. And this money? Is there some more money that we missed? Watch out, lady. Oh, you guys, this is cool the way they did this. Look at this cutout here. An upside down diamond cutout for a window. That's neat, we're getting some good ideas here. Okay. All right, let's see if we can find these zombies. Oh, hey, King. What do you, so what do you uh, want? <laughs> uh, hello, adventurer, and welcome to my humble abode. Uh, it's really not that humble. I'm afraid to say it, but you are the first to arrive for my big birthday bash. Oh, ha I mean, happy birthday, King. Okay, so we still have those zombies to defeat, though. Are they down there somewhere? Do you see them, Sheila? All right. We're leaving the Cloud Palace. Wait, what's over there? Is that where the zombies are? Yeah, I know you got a zombie problem, but I don't see any zombies. Where are these alleged zombies? Are they over here? Okay, let's, oh, well, there we go. I think the zombies are down here, you guys. So Sheila, get out your black katana. All right, let's find these zombies. Where are they? There they are. There we go. Yeah, you guys will never get her in that cloud palace. <laughs> Unless you have a broom or something. Get him, Sheila. Okay, that's one. Let's get the other ones. That's right, buddy. Where are the other ones? Is that it? I guess that was it. Should we go back up there and see if she's gonna give us something? Let's get our broom. Let's hop on the broom. All right, where's the cloud palace? Is that it? There it is. Oh no, the zombies are up there, you guys. The zombies made it. All right, Sheila. Uh oh, did they already get her? I think they already got her. <laughs> Sheila, we were too late. You did try, Sheila. You, you tried your best. <laughs> Whoops, sorry lady. We tried. <laughs> All right, let's get out of here. <laughs> Woohoo! Let's get our bricks into Pugsy. Or brick? We got one or two. We got one, yay! <laughs> Let's hop into Pugsy, and let's head home to the Ivory Tower. All right, Ivory Tower, we're on our way home to Ivory City. So this is what Sheila sees when she's flying home. Look at this. This is really neat. <laughs> we got a phone, we got a tape player, we got a toilet meter, a light. Oh, there we go. There we go. 
We're entering the atmosphere of Ivory City. So it's a little bit glitchy. Um, <laughs> there's kind of a weird glitch. Uh, we end up in a really odd spot every time. There we go. <laughs> so because this is actually, we started building this world when the game was in beta. So it's kind of an unusual situation. Uh, the rocket disappears and it drops us off where we built this dinosaur enclosure forever ago. It was like, what episode was that? It's like episode five or something. And it's still here. And Rex, Rex, how did you get out of there? Dude. I don't know how he escaped from the dinosaur enclosure. But let's head back. So Ivory City, I think, is right over here. So we're gonna head over to Ivory City. Hey, Barbara. What? Are you, be careful with that. What are you doing? Oh, man. All right, so we are on the shore of Ivory City. So you guys, this island is pretty big. So I think we can do a lot of building before we fill up the island. It's pretty neat. Oh, look at Sheila's old spaceship. Hey, spaceship! <laughs> That's from episode, like, 50 something. 51, I think. And it's still here. Uh, where's the ivory tower? There's the dinosaur park. There's the pirate ship. There's the ivory tower. Oh! You guys, there's Ragnarok. That's our gold dragon. Hey, Ragnarok! Huh, I don't know what he's doing. <laughs> he's looking at the pirate ship. So this, oh. oh no, Sheila, run! Sheila! <laughs> Where is he? <sighs> Hopefully he didn't see us. Uh, this is a pirate ship. One day it's going to be a restaurant. Fine dining, actually. Um, not yet, but it will be. You guys just wait, it'll be awesome. Okay, let's go up to the tower and we'll talk about the project that we're going to do today. So, these are the stairs, the entry to the ivory tower. You know what, buddy? Alright, so let's get out the crystal bow. I think that'll teach him a lesson. Yep, yeah, there we go. He has crystal hearts, so a crystal weapon usually works pretty well. Sheila, get him! Get him, Sheila! Oh no! <laughs> All right, get that crystal bow back out. Get him, Sheila. Where'd he go? This wizard is so annoying. Sheila, get him. Man, he's powerful. Okay, well, we're not going to mess with him. Okay. Oh, no, they, he took our fish. Get the fish back, Sheila. All right. So these are the stairs to the ivory tower, right? And they're really cool, but they're kind of windy. And we like the way they look here. They're nice and wide. So we're going to remove these windy stairs here. We're going to make this one like it's going to go up a little further and then it's going to go straight up here. Or maybe it'll turn once and then go up. But they'll be like the wider stairs. So they're going to look more substantial. And then over here, we want to build like in this area, we want to build a courtyard area with planters and benches, like something that you would see at the entrance of like a really nice building. So that's all gonna be right in this area and the stairs will branch off to the courtyard and they'll also branch off down uh, to the entrance right over here. So yeah. All right, Sheila, you ready to get started? You wanna do some uh, building? Yeah? Sheila loves to build with Legos. It's like her favorite thing in the world. I mean, it's really fun. <laughs> All right, guys, we're going to go into speed build mode and we'll see you when we're all done.
All right, guys, we are all done building for now, and it looks pretty amazing. So, Sheila, why don't you stop playing with the bones and uh, show everybody the awesome improvements that we've made. So we added a bunch of vines and flowers to the front entry, and they're kind of growing up the... Uh, lamp posts and up the stairs a little bit here so it's pretty sweet so these are the brand new stairs we removed the other stairs and we put in these awesome brand new stairs instead of winding around they go in this direction and then up in this direction they're pretty amazing sheila that is not how you use stairs what are you doing lady you guys this is the brand new courtyard and it's pretty incredible we're gonna get some benches in here and we're gonna get a bunch of flowers we built the courtyard around the trees that were already here and we also built it around the ruins because we don't want to change too much of the landscape because it's really cool the way it already is so now we're in Sheila's point of view here and we're going to check out the brand new additions oh hey horsey coming along for the ride <laughs> okay we don't have any carrots sorry um, so this is the terrace over here, this is the edge, and if you look down over here, we'll jump up, you can see the dock down here and the back stairs that go up to the ivory tower, which is right up here. And so in this courtyard, people can hang out, they can talk and have fun, and we can have some parties out here. It's pretty amazing. So the stairs go up this way, and they branch off so you can go down to the rest of the city or we can go up to the tower. So we're gonna head up here and show you guys. Down here we built another courtyard that you can access by taking some stairs through here. So let's do that. Let's go back into Sheila's point of view. And let's head down the stairs. But you're very well lit at night, so it should be pretty easy to get around here. So instead of going down this way, we're gonna go down over here. And then we're gonna go through, there's a tunnel right through here. It's pretty neat. And we use the um, inverted slope bricks and then the regular slope bricks to create this uh, this really cool like layered effect here. So let's head over here. And this is the secondary courtyard where we've got uh, Kim Claudashian hanging out waiting for her fish. You guys, we didn't we didn't find any fish for her. Uh, sorry, Kim Claudashian. We'll keep looking for that fish that you want. She's so picky. She wants like salmon or something. Something very specific. We got like rainbow trout and she was like <laughs> So on this courtyard, we'll probably put some more tables and we'll put some cafe lighting. It'd be pretty neat. So back here, if you go up these stairs, look out Kim Kardashian. These stairs are kind of the backside of the front door here. It's pretty cool, look at that. It's amazing. <laughs> Alright guys, thank you so much for watching, and if you enjoyed the episode, please give it a thumbs up. And if you want to follow Sheila's amazing adventures, then please subscribe. Thanks guys, bye bye